Oh. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back into the channel for episode number... Guys, I'm not even going to try to know. I don't know what it is at this point. There are so many episodes and I'm accepting that. So what I can tell you is how we ended last episode, which was... Oh, this this thing always comes off. Um, <laughs> anyways, we ended last episode with uh, finding out that there's whispers of a single lone male trespasser so we are gonna be headed towards roughly the area that i mean dina took her best guess which was hillcrest so we're gonna head to hillcrest to try to see if we can link up and hopefully it is tommy and hopefully he's alive as well so guys without further ado i hope you guys enjoy this episode of the last of us let's go let's go okay hillcrest is this the right place? Kind of reminds me of Bill's area. Definitely the right place. Oh yeah, shots fired and something rustic, something, something dark tough. side. Oh, shit. All right, survey the whole area. Tommy's still gonna be there. Everything's gonna be fine. Let's get our loot on, you guys. Also, Ellie inspired my outfit for today. I was like, I have a green shirt like that. I didn't rip off this leaves, but I have a green shirt like that. All right, so we found some right off the rip. Give me that. Oh, I thought it was a silencer. We have 40 core supplements. <gasps> oh, improved silencers. It is a good day to be alive. It's a beautiful day. All right, go through. Mm, did I fully explore that? Damn it, you know when you forget about something as quickly as you found it? Okay, yeah, just tissues. You know, the things that I could really use but don't have right now. Hmm. We can break in through here. We were able to see through it. Ah, oh, nice, more pills. So how many do we need? Hold on, you guys. I've been way too excited for this. Faster stealth kills. We need 60, so we need a total of like 50. Uh, 47. 47 left. Quick maths. No more items in here. Mm. I'm surprised we were able to. <gasps> more pills. Is this going to be where we get the upgrade? I actually want to find another manual because if you notice, there's definitely one outstanding. Uh, there's one thing locked currently. So we. Which kind of sucks because if you actually miss the manual, which I think they do try to put the manual more in a neutral location, despite if you're really good with looting or not. Uh, but if you missed it, that's a whole web that you're not able to get or a skill, like a bunch of skills. Hmm. I see the note. Noise. Priorities. Priorities. Let's swap our weapon too. Get the silencer on. Her, we need rags or we need to find. I thought we had so many extra silencers, but I guess I did go a little uh, guns a-blazing a couple episodes ago. They think we're sheep. Bear your fangs. Join the Washington Liberation Front. I'm so tired of their propaganda bullshit. Bullshit, bullshit, bullshit. Don't like that. All right. Community board. Watch your stuff. <gasps> Wait, hold on. That's saying I am full on my silencer. Oh, I do have one. Oh, I do have one. No, wait. It says one in my spare. Okay, I see. I'm sorry. Yeah, I have like a spare. Oh, that's kind of stupid. I guess that counts. So, I recently saw Terrifier 2. Do not recommend it all. Um, like, I have seen a lot of horror movies, and that one just takes the cake on being probably, like, the most hard to watch more than uh, Hostel, the Hostel series. But now I can't see laundry mats the same. Yeah, I wish I could unsee everything. I mean, you guys know. Love. Love me some slashers, but that goes beyond the bounds of slashers and classics. It's just gore porn. Just daily thoughts of Maggie. <laughs> mm. 
Hmm. The full plaid suit. Aggressive with the checkered undershirt. A little aggressive. Also very long coat. Very long coat. I'm getting a... Uh... Okay, we're going to go through that way. Oh, wait. Or, or we're going to go through that way. Mm, they put a rat there to show you where you have to go, I think. Okay, I can't break through there. Nothing else. Yeah, I think we can't progress forward. We can. Wait. Is there something in the car? No! Okay. There is. I mean, we can go behind... Uh, we can go behind the buildings, too. So I would say we go behind the buildings first. And then let's go through. Like, then we can crawl through whatever that was. Ever since you guys told me about the smashing with my melee, you know I've been going crazy with it. Smash from the other side. All right, perfect. We needed that, but we actually need rags more than anything. Hmm. There wasn't anything. Around the back. Um, this goes to the middle building, right? I think... Yeah, this was just the same. Yeah. So there wasn't anything in that one building. Interesting. Hmm. Okay, let's unlock this first. This might be a workbench, actually. I have a feeling this might be a, yeah, I think it's a workbench, which, now that I think about it, did I miss a workbench in the last episode? Like, I feel like I missed a workbench where, um, we, like, went through somewhere and maybe I just completely passed by it. No, it was the radio area. The radio area. It didn't have a workbench. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Workbench. And a trophy. Huh. Boris. Leg is off. Leg is off. Sunnyvale Archery. First place. I wonder if that means they have like bows or anything. Like, is there a manual down here to wait? Yeah, I'm like, is there a manual for us to be able to upgrade our archery? We don't have a bow on us, do we? It's oh, pretty good. Happy birthday, Dad. The best clicker killer in the whole QZ. Oh, that's actually so cute. Nice, six of those. Mmm. Was that 17? <gasps> Be still my beating heart. And some revolver ammo. And more over here. Oh, I wish we had the bow. I think that was my favorite method in the first one. After a while, I got really used to using the bow. All right, so I think I told you guys that we were gonna start putting into the shoddy, just because this should have all of the upgrades as of right now done. Yeah. We're maxed on our semi-auto, which is my go-to choice. Revolver's next, not a big fan. Although we usually have to turn to it in times of need, but let's go over here. Yeah, shotgun's really great for the last minute panic, so let's do capacity, and then we're gonna have to save up for something after. It's those small details that they do in this. Mm. Uh, you know, I used to try to like have an objective as to what we're gonna put it into next, but to be completely honest, by the time I get to the next point, I've forgotten what I said anyway. So look, let's just roll out of here. I feel like I haven't found enough pieces. Like maybe I've missed a lot of pieces somewhere. Hmm. I also feel like this would be the perfect location for, like, a, a manual of some sort, but it's okay. All right, we went through the laundry mat, so I think we do just have to scale that vehicle right there. Yeah, we can jump up on that. Rustin Coffee. How do I get up there? Okay, never mind. You're telling me they didn't look that? Hold on, Tommy. Just hold on. We're going on. 
Uh, this is a whole nother route. That's to get to Caroline Paper Company. But don't we just want to go? Oh man, I'm going to get overwhelmed. There's so many different routes we can go. Also, I need to be weary of uh, traps. I'm kind of running through willy nilly. Oh, cool. We offer free deliveries. Oh, check it out. Oh, there's not actually anything in it. I'm just going around breaking glass everywhere. All right, I'll take that. All right, we can shimmy through over there and a note. Hmm, Boris. Oh, Boris, yeah. Wolves broke into Fedra HQ and found the enlisted rosters. I've heard they're starting to knock on doors, looking for soldiers. I'm not going to be executed in my own town. After things calm down, I'll try to return with a new name. I couldn't find Alfie. I put his food back on your- Oh, I put his food on your back porch. In case I don't come back, give him lots of scratches for me. He always loved you and Sophia. Yolanda. Ah. Jeez. American flag. Alright, let's go out through this way. Alright, so we could have jumped this route. But this might be... Okay. Let's go through the coffee first, and then before we press towards that direction, let's actually go that, the, the way that I started to go and then I turned around. We'll go that way next. Hold on. Unless it's me on the floorboards. Rat. Mr. Scappers. Alright, a rag. I think that's what I needed. I want to be able to up the amount of silencers I can carry. I don't have any- I don't have any shotgun bullets. Oh no. Oh, did it hear? Step in from the rain. Try our hot chocolate. Only if there's marshmallows. Yeah, but see, if I hadn't smashed everything I found, I actually wouldn't have come across that one baseball card, or uh, superhero card. Uh... Oh, interesting. Okay, I see. Up there. We can climb through the window. Yeah, we're gonna have to go to the left side. We can pull this down, maybe? Hmm. Oh, F the WLF. Very interesting. So that's got to be the scars, right? They they seem to use graffiti the most. I haven't been I haven't been keeping up with this. Hold on, let me scroll back. Okay, okay, we missed. That's right. That's right. All right. What do I do here? How do I? We just started. I shouldn't have said that to her. She's gonna treat me different now. I know it. I wish my mask didn't break. When did she figure out she was pregnant? Where were we a couple weeks ago? Boise? I remember her throwing up in Kennywick? This is too much. It's all- wait, wait. It all makes sense. The throwing up? How tired she's been? What the hell, Dina? Why didn't you just tell me? Why didn't you trust me? But did you trust her? What should I do? It's too late to turn back. I just gotta end this whole thing as quickly as possible. That's the uh, context I was missing from the last chapter. Mm. So, that board is actually covering... Oh, no, 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 maybe it's not. But then how do we get through? Hold on. Hold up, wait. Yeah, this is blocked like that. There's a way to get through. I'm not able to break into it from the front. Hmm. Mm, was there something through the bathroom? No. Yes, yes, yes! Ooh, sneaky, sneaky. Ugh, gross. Ugh. This better yield something nice, okay? This better be nice. Yeah, the board was blocking most of it. Alright, what do we got? <gasps> do you feel that? I feel like that's an upgrade manual. I just feel it, maybe not. This was kind of a... Lesser, like you would have had to look for it. Oh no, okay, never mind. <laughs> I also don't even need that ammo. How's my health? Okay, health's perfect. I don't need any of this stuff. Of course. Oh, oh, oh. Although I do need that. 
Hold up. Wait. Yeah, I think the uh, manuals are going to be in more obvious spots. Oh. All right, let's go to the other side and then we'll come back around here. I feel like the other location is going to be the route that we can't go back for, you know? They've been a little bit more brutal about that in this game. See, you guys said to smash the cars, but we haven't found anything in the cars yet. I'm just saying. Break the windows. Hello? Anybody home? It's so weird where they have the... <laughs> the price tags look exactly like... Is it um Lowe's or Home Depot? I feel like... Oh, like the Home Depot ones. Like the font and everything looks exactly like that. I'll take those. I'm never going to turn down some supplements. And another... Yeah? Yeah? Okay, we needed the shotgun shells and more pills. I know it's just two, but every little bit helps. And there's a note as well. Anybody we recognize? Boris. Okay, another thing to Boris. What did we get ourselves into? The wolves were supposed to make things better. The military hoarded all the resources, controlled what we said, told us what job to do, and so far the wolves are doing the exact same thing. And now they're talking about moving everyone to the stadium? What? I grew up in this town. I survived the outbreak in this town. And I'm not moving to some refugee camp where some asshole tells me where I can or can't wipe my own ass. This is my home. We need a plan. We can't settle for the same. Yuli. Mmm... So, a Boris. I don't remember a Boris on the wanted posters. I do think it's important to remember there were two individuals on the... There were still two individuals on those wanted posters. So I want to make sure I don't forget those. Just in case. Exactly. Alright, let's go ahead and put some pep in our step here. Hmm. Boris. I really want to... I can't wait to actually meet the people that we're, like, reading about. Like, I do want to meet... Is it Isaiah? Isaiah. Okay, that's blocked off. We're going to jump over here. Hmm. The perimeter until we it's been out. a while. Keep an eye out in case it comes it's this way. oh a dog. Shoot. Okay. I got something. Not good. Infected? I'm gonna have to kill this dog. Damn it! I'm gonna have to kill this dog. Okay, girl. Hold R1 to see your scent trail. You think this guy's connected to the girl from the school? That'd be a hell of a coincidence if they weren't. Make dogs lose your scent by moving groups. away or distracting them. Big groups. It's a straight fight. These loners. They could be hiding anywhere. Hear you. Let's find him. How am I supposed to lose my scent? Emma! Fucking ambush! That way! He can Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Okay, I'm panicking, I'm panicking! The dog is on me! Ah! I don't wanna kill the dog! But I have to! Not with the shotgun! Don't kill the Oh, I'm so sorry. No. <laughs> I did it. I'm sorry. I didn't want to. Oh my, the silencer. Okay. I got a headshot right there. Okay, you know what? We weren't trying to sneak around. Please don't make me do this. Oh man. This is so... This is so... This is... Wow. Okay. Alright. Well, at least I can loot some stuff. I don't think there's another dog. They should come in here, through here. Guys, with these people, with the dogs, that's just going to be a hard thing for me to... Bye bye Alright. One moving up. Rifle. Wait for them to duck down, although I'm not giving them counterfire, so they might not duck. Hmm... Alright. Uh, oh, shoot. 
I'm meleeing, I'm meleeing, I'm meleeing. Oh shit, 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 shit. No, I'm so sorry. I dodged it. I dodged it. Can I just choke the dog out instead of killing it? Do we really have to kill it? Oh god, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, I need to heal. It's not over yet. We don't have a... Okay, there's no audio cue. Oh man, come on. I just like, I don't even like, look, I'm a cat person. I'm a cat person. That doesn't mean I want to kill a dog. I guess I've done it before in game, so is it that big of a deal? No. Just morally, I'm conflicted. <laughs> Ugh. All right. Let's loot the place. At least until we find. Uh, there's got to be one more person. There's something else. Mm, there's a safe here. No items. <laughs> Alright, let's go loot bodies. Also, here's the aggravating part about dogs, too, is I have to use a bullet to kill them or go melee, but I'm never gonna get back. Like, they're not gonna drop stuff, you know? They're not gonna drop stuff, so it's like... It feels a little bit... like a waste. But I guess you could melee them, yes. Oh, yeah, I see him, I see him, I see him, I see him. Alright. That should be the last one, so let's go ahead and just rifle that bad boy. Okay. Okay. Nice. All right, let's stand back up, free run around. There was zero trying to be silent there, but I also don't regret it. I just, the amount of haste I applied once the dog was onto my scent, I just didn't. I didn't want to be near it. Definitely panicky. Definitely panicky. But I'm okay with it. Hmm. We also need to pick up another melee weapon here soon. We've got two strikes left on this. Oh, thank goodness. I also, my character tried to, or at least tried to switch to the shotgun after I... I guess I like meleeed the dog and somehow it automatically went to the shotgun. I mean, I must have just picked it accidentally. Hmm. All right, we can't break those. Go through another one, but I think I did kill somebody around here, so there should be a body. No? Break the window. I'm starting to feel like there's not items in the car because that that also would be so many cars you have to break, you know? Like that'd be so many. This looks very creepy. This one's super run down. There's not a whole lot here. Hmm. Nope. But we can use it to get around back. Nothing. Uh, maybe this is how we get through this door. Or probably not. These ones are messed up. These ones look like they got burnt down or something. It's definitely not your normal wear and tear. Yeah. These definitely were burnt. I mean, all of this was created too to have you probably either sneak through or have the dogs lose your scent. We just went with the brute force. It worked. Can I crawl under that, by the way? No. Hmm. Nothing. None of them are leaving us bodies. Okay, did we go through this mart? I don't recognize it. But if we could get behind that, I bet there's something good. Let's see. Actually, let's go ahead and craft. We need to re-up our materials. Uh, I'm out of rags. Hmm. That's where we came from, right? Yeah, jewelry store. And we're not going to be able to get behind there. That's fine. It's the red door. I'm guessing. Just looks very ominous. 
giving me insidious vibes. Yeah. All right. It felt a little uh, empty in terms of it's a Pegasus. Yeah, it felt kind of empty with how many items you could get there, but that's fine. I'm seeing a flashlight. Or that's my flashlight. <laughs> Never mind. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're supposed to sneak around and not go full stab hack and slash there. See, I'm confused by that. Hold on. If I go to my weapon, how do I put the silencer on the weapon? Because I have one in my inventory, no? It's showing zero. I get that. But then it's showing one in the reserves, right? See how it... See, I think I'm missing something there. Like, how do I... Hmm... Mmm. No, it's nothing on the D-pad. We'll figure it out. I'll just, I'll craft another one too. It's, the silencers come in handy, but also after a certain bit, even if you use a silencer to kill them, they still hear after a certain amount or they'll find the body. Alright, we're probably jumping up there, but let's just go ahead and run around back. Yep. Are we gonna need this? Yeah. I figured we were just gonna need... Fuck. Anybody hear that? Probably. <gasps> yes. Little bits and pieces. See... Do we really need that? Because I thought we'd just be able to jump up on... No. Okay, that's fair. It's like just shy of not being able to jump up on it. Mm. This one's a little nasty. I think I have to... <laughs> I'm gonna have to jump on it really quickly. Go, 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 go! No. Uh, is there something I can block it with? Or maybe you just have to... Okay, let's think about this. Maybe we just put it up against the side that it's probably not gonna roll down because it's not as big of a ramp. That would make more sense. <laughs> they just wanted to see how many people would make a fool out of themselves. <laughs> okay, I definitely sense tool parts here. Lots of bikes. Bike shop. Ooh. That's not bad. Note. Okay, here we go. Boris and Yuli again. Boris, I'm so sorry. What those wolves did to Sophia was horrifying. I can't help but feel somewhat responsible. I've been getting the town so riled up about standing our ground against the wolves. When she started spray painting over their rules, I didn't discourage her hard enough. I kept it from you. I thought she'd stop. I know you want to retaliate against the wolves. Believe me, I feel the same way, but we can't. Not now. We've got to be smart. Let things cool down. People will look. People will be looking to you for how to handle this. You were a leader here after the outbreak. I need you to be a leader again. Let's not forget everything we fought to be in vain. Let's not let everything we fought for to be in vain. What did they do to Sophia? 15 parts? Great balls of fire. All right. And more? No, rag. Hmm. I need one more rag. Oh. The wolves just. Oh! <gasps> New thing! Mm. New items. Some kind of bomb? Trap mines! There we go. That's what I've been waiting for. Yes, I have been waiting for something like that. Let's go. Uh, workbench, I don't think I really have. I have 45 bits. Uh, let's go into shotgun. That's shoddy. Fire rate, stability. Oh. Ooh, ooh. Let's go fire rate. And then we'll go stability after. 
Yes, yes, good, good. Perfect. All right, we have five. <laughs> we only have five pieces left, but that's okay. You guys know how I feel when I have to leave snacks behind. The pain it causes me. This is a nice bike shop. Superhero card. I just feel like a, ba or a bike shop would have a superhero card. The valley. Ooh, the valley looks creepy. It's giving me the shack vibes. Foreign bootleg. This person like music and film. Air. But yeah, guys, I'm a little concerned. It's been a while. It's been a while. It's been a while since we've seen a superhero card, and I don't like that. It makes me feel like I forgot something. All right, let's jump into here. Mm. Cola. This was like a food place. Yeah. Renegade. Brutally refreshing taste. Why does it make me think of uh, a rip it? That's what it's giving me vibes from. Strawberry ice cream. Soft serve. Mm. All right, no revolver. No revolver. I don't like you. Be gone. I didn't have to use the, um, I didn't have to use the health packs. All right, before we jump down there, uh, I really, like, I do want to jump down there, but I want to explore everything else first, too. I don't trust it. Wait, 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 wait. If we see the way out, then I'm fine with it. No. Uh. Hmm. I don't think there's gonna be a way out. I. Hmm. You... Well, real quick, hold on. In the most unlikely of all places. Yeah, I think that's gonna be the way to get across right there. Because we have to continue going up, yeah. Okay, it's a good thing I didn't hop down there. Huh. A tattoo, tattoo shop. tattoo shop. Oh no. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to be honest, guys. I don't think I would get a tattoo. And I don't have a lot to begin with, but I don't think I would get a tattoo based off of the leopard print chairs. Or maybe that's why I would get a tattoo here. <laughs> I'm not sure about that. Oh, man. You're also talking to the, like, the person that makes these amazing, elaborate artists do, like, the tiniest little word art. <laughs> Just a tiny little phrase. I know your skills exceed this beyond measure, but can you just do one of those basic bitch <laughs> little scrollings? Little scrawling. Hmm. Yeah. It's a cool tattoo shop, though. <laughs> See, I always, like, have these, like, wants. I, I always feel like I would... I would want to do something bigger and bolder and cooler and, like, actually a graphic design, but... I just, I, I, I never can pull the trigger. It's like great in theory. And then I would get to the shop and I would chicken out. I can't do it. Yuli, you know, our hearts will always be with Hillcrest, but after Sophia's shooting, we've decided to head to the stadium with the others. We've got our own kids to think about the Brandmans. P.S. Saw Boris a couple hours ago. We tried talking to him, but he seemed off. Please talk to him. I hope you guys will join us. Dot, dot, dot. Hmm. They have their own kids to think about. All right, nothing at back, but... Hold on. What? You're not going to put anything there? There's a lot to be explored here. I think this is just to be able to get into this door. I don't think that's actually to jump on top of. Yeah. <gasps> oh God. All right, I gotta run real quick. Hold on. Uh, hold on, I'm dodging, I'm dodging, I'm dodging. Jump up, jump up, jump up. Hold on. He's gonna climb up. All right. 
What the hell? What the heck? I guess they... They knew just by... Yeah, I know that's... I know. Trust me, I know where you want me to go. That must have been, um... Just by me opening the door, they heard me. Hey, at least I can go back and get those snacks now. Those snacks. That is just... I, the game has been doing that. I will say the second game has upped the ante with that. Like, they've done multiple... Like they've been locked in here for years. Yeah. They've done multiple, like, jump scares like that with them. I love it. It's just, you don't expect it. Oh, in the safe. Hold on. Let me try to find the code first, though. Mm. That's so cool. I love how much it seems like the devs appreciate and have a love for music. You know. Safe combination in your seven supplement parts, too. Guys, this is a gold mine. This was so worth the two, three shotgun shell shots. Whatever. I think it took three. Work schedule. Hey, Tom, check the carburetor. Work schedule, September... Okay, I don't see a note that would tell us what it would be. Huh. Usually there's something pretty clear and distinctive that says what the safe code could be. Maybe it's in the... Hmm. This is a round back for one of the shops. So it's also possible it's connected to the auto shop. Is this still the tattoo shop? No, this is something different. Okay, let me just fully explore maybe the building right in front of it, and maybe we can find something. It's the hairdresser. The hairdresser knows the code. Oh, oh, oh! I can't believe I almost missed that. Hmm. That ain't bad. Sheer Lux. Yeah, it's, it's not... Hmm... I mean, we can always use our hearing tactic. Shall we? I'll do one more quick look in their office and around. Maybe there's something on the bulletin board that you just can't see. Like, I see we need more nines. But that doesn't... Yeah. No, they would definitely make it clear what the code is. Which is why it's interesting it's not in here. September 9th, it's the same things on the bulletin board. And you can't open anything in the drawers. We'll find it later, but actually, I say we just... Listen. Is this one of the long ones, though? Hold on. All right, I think it's because she blew past the initial ones. Like, I, she started, like, blasting past them. Hold on, hear me out. What if we close the door? No. I thought there could have been something behind the door. There's no numbers in these. All right, let's go to the one of the other shops might have it. So let's keep exploring the other shops. I think somebody brought up a really good point that I liked. It was like, yeah, it's all fun and games to try to, you know do it just by sound alone but you do miss some of the some of the little uh details although that being said like i think i still found them like i still found the employee of the month and stuff like that i just more infected all right let's look for a note oh no you guys it's one of the new ones okay it's one of the newer guys we can try this new bomb thing. You want to? Uh, shotgun for him. I think it was like two shotguns to the face. Worked wonders. Let's get him to step on this. 
Oh, I have to drop it where? Okay, so this is different. Fuck. Shambler. Do I have to light that? Okay, we're gonna cause him to freak out and come over here and we're gonna get him to step on it and Let's see what happens. Let's also see like he's not gonna notice us because if we're crouched down He's gonna explode, but he's not gonna notice us, you know Oh, he's pissed I want to see their senses like, do they know? Okay, he ran through there. They both ran somewhere else. Oh, shit. This is cool. I haven't really played around with what they do when they don't know where you are, but they know something. Oh, wow. Okay, that was perfect. It brought it should have brought both of them down. The the runner went by it. He should have been lit on fire. Yes, perfect. Good, 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 good. I think it's just those two. Okay, that's I mean, honestly, those guys go down pretty easily. Yes. So, a Molotov and one of these traps to the face. I will take that. We'll go ahead and max our Molotovs. And, oh, I didn't take any damage, actually, when I fought those things. I didn't take any damage. He's still alive, by the way. Stupid. I don't have another brick. Mmm. That feels kind of sketchy, because I... He definitely ran over the fire. You know? Oh, maybe he did burn to death. No. All right, he's through there. We can wait for him to come over here and then just silent do a little. We can, oh, we can't silent take down fast enough yet. I can't wait to be able to test that out though. All right, let's look for a code. Look for something. This reminds me of a, uh... here we go. Come over here, come over here. I got him. Three, four, five, six. I feel like it takes about six seconds for her to silent take someone down right now. So let's compare that to, and that's a rough estimate. I would say six to seven seconds. Maybe I was a little too generous on the seconds. But that's the rough. Here, safe code. Yep. Mm, mm. Let's go. Yo, when Dale comes by, he's going to ask for the safe combo. But just walk over to the garage and put it in yourself. Otherwise, he's going to bother you eight more times. The combo is 30-82-65. Someone needs to talk to his wife. I know she wants to think he's going to get better, but it's time to get practical. I heard the WLF have some real doctors at their base. Nobody would blame her for leaving except Boris. But, uh, F him. Okay, so I think we'll just find some items here and then we'll go get that. Sa oh, sweet, sweet supplements. Yeah, we'll finish out looting this area. Mm. Of course, they make you work for the safe, which is fair enough. I respect it. All right, so two things to make note of. This is how we're going to progress to the next spot. So we'll come back here. And then that means we also need to drop down to the base and figure out what is over there. Item. Uh, let's pick up that bottle. There we go. Yeah, so go back to safe. Then let's drop down into that weird hole. Oh, I don't think we went over here, did we? Ellie? Oh no, I, fr <laughs> I made it freak out because I was sprinting while asking her to do something. 
Yuli, it was Boris. I saw him shoot the WLF patrol against their own van. Jesus, I get it. They killed his daughter, but he just signed his death warrant. We have one chance out of this. We turn him, turn him in. I know he's your friend, but if those wolves shot that girl over some graffiti, think of what they'll do to all of us when they know we're harboring a killer of three of their own. Let's just meet at the usual place after curfew. X. Xavier? This mysterious X. Interesting. <gasps> 16 supplements, you guys! We can do- No. Yes! Yes! Faster stealth kills. Let's go! Okay, and now we have, now we're in a great spot. We have excess supplements. However, what if? And hear me out. Like when it comes to crafting stuff, I'm like, mm. um. Okay, but these do. Okay, so some of these are important. So crafting melee upgrades, restoring it in full durability greatly increases its damage. That is kind of nice. I will say that once you find a good melee weapon you want, we can then keep it instead of having to find something else once it's done. And then this one, 100% crafting speed. Like, I don't care so much about that. I'm never really crafting in a when I'm in a pickle, so it's not the most useful thing. Stun bombs become smoke bombs, which I haven't been using those whatsoever. Craft more effective health kits. That would be kind of nice. Increasing your efficiency at crafting smoke bombs, producing more from the same resources. Craft amount one equals two now. One goes to two and inventory capacity goes to four. Hear me out, they're good, but I don't think they're enough for me to start putting into them yet. I need to compare it to whatever manual we get next. And then I'll have like, I'll have so many supplements we can pick and choose from there. I just, I feel like I'm willing to wait on the perks that it would grant you just to make sure we're not, I, I have a feeling we'll be able to upgrade all of them. I'm not too worried about it, but I'm going to do it this way. I know I'm overthinking it. I, I probably will be able to upgrade all of them at some point. All right. I want to say it was 30, 90 something, 30, 17, 38. Uh, it was a note, wasn't it? Turning Boris. Nope. Not turning Boris. Nope. Sorry. Dale's combo. 30, 82, 65. 30, 82, 65. 30, 82, 65. All right. 30. 82. It's funny that it doesn't make you go right to left. 62. I'm just kind of going, actually, can you go down? Yeah, you can go down too. 62. It wasn't 62, it was 80. Was it 88? Oh my, was it 60, is 66, 63? Oh my gosh, great balls of fire, what is it? 65, where did I get 62? Oh, oh, 30, 62, 50, 65. Don't look at me like that. 30, 62. I'm sorry, 82. And then 60, 50, 65. There we go. Yes. I should have known too because it didn't give you, it gave you red before I think I even pulled the trigger on it. <gasps> Do you guys see that? Is that another holster? <gasps> mm. There we go. The quick. Oh, the quick switcheroo. Yes, the shotgun holster. You love to see it. Oh, that was such a good save. Mmm, 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 mmm. I know I'm ridiculous. It's just, uh, those are the, it's the little things that get you excited. All right, let's go through the shop. And jump down. All right, I wonder what we're going to find at the base of this. I definitely saw some items when we jumped down, but I have a feeling there could be infected. Possibly infected. Only one way to find out. Oh, come on. Ah, that's how you attach. There you go. I'm guessing it's just one. I, re 
regret it. We shouldn't have gone down. I regret it. Oh, hell no. Hell no. That was a big old bag of bullshit. Oh God. I don't trust the light. I don't care what you tell me. I don't care what the game tells me. I'm gonna turn the light off when I see infected. There's two. There's two big daddies. I've now dubbed the name of those big daddies. Here's what we're gonna do. So as soon as he comes over here, cause we're gonna throw a bottle, but they're both gonna come if I throw a bottle. Oh man. I could put a couple silent shots in this one. Uh, when he comes back through and walks over, we'll put some silent shots in him, get him to come over here at least, and then we'll throw the Molotov after. If he come, okay, he's coming back over. I, let's be honest, we're all thinking it. We're about to see some panic runs, y'all. There's about to be some panicky. <laughs> all right, keep your cool. Keep your cool. Keep your cool. Burn the body, make the other one come near. Yes, okay, he's stepping over it. He's stepping over it. He doesn't know what to do. He's confused. I'm gonna shoot the... Uh, we just always... Uh, he's not burning to death. He's definitely not burning to death. He's still alive. I say we just throw another Molotov at him. And I set fire. <laughs> Let him ring. All right, that should be That'll do that'll do all right, that should be good All right lights back on lights back on the cute little butt cheeks done uh, The only problem is there's Smell. nothing Hey shamblers The the shamblers aka big daddies Oh, this one got wrecked, y'all. This one got messed up. Like, what even is that? Oh, man. Ooh. Oh, imagine what it's going to do to a person when we use it. Mm, I can only hold three shells. Oh, you hate to see it. All right. See, and I also keep the... I think I now keep the semi-auto on because if I do accidentally fire one off, at least I don't get punished for it, you know? Because the silencer will at least muffle it so I don't... They don't get notified that I'm right here. Because you guys know, sometimes, you know, you just fire from the hip and it's an accident, but... It do be like that. Alright, the rifle ammo we already saw. This is messed up, but at least we don't have to pretend to put a mask on anymore. I suppose you could have just snuck through this, and that's probably their intention behind it. Is to just sneak through. I think that's what you're supposed to do. Uh, medkit. Do I need it? No, somehow I didn't take damage in that one fight. Alright. What did I really do that for, though? Because I feel like it wasn't for, uh... It wasn't for those three little bits and bobs we found. There has to be something better here. Oh, yep, okay. For ten supplements, I'll take that. I will definitely spend those resources for 10 supplements. Are you kidding me? Make another Molotov, make another mine. I think the trap mines have become my favorite. I feel like I just heard some growling. Did you guys hear that? It might just be my stomach. <laughs> it's definitely my stomach growling right now. All right, nothing over there. Just be sure. Where does this take us out at? The other side of the building, maybe? Oh, it's a, it was a children's place. Um, 
a general. We am a general. Okay. Nothing. Reminds me. Mmm. <gasps> mmm. What did I tell you guys? I knew soon, but I am so glad that we waited. I'm so glad we waited. Look, hunting rifle scopes reviewed and rated. This is so perfect. Your biggest hunting news source. Oh, bargain hunter. 10 things to know before you skin that deer. That's so funny. How to find amazing deals on knives, cameras, night vision, goggles, and other gear. That's hilarious. I was just talking yesterday about hunting. 15 hunting rifle scopes reviewed and rated. All right, guys, let's see it. Mmm, mmm, branch precision. This should be the last one too. Nope, nope, nope. What do you mean it's not the last one? Oh my, there's more, but wait, there's more. <laughs> All right, aim stability increased. This is what I was waiting for, and I'm so glad that I had that conversation not even like 15 minutes ago with you guys. All right, so what is it? Improves the aiming stability and accuracy while moving. Move faster while aiming. Oh. Detected enemy. We detect enemies at a greater distance in listening mode. Let's go. Uh, aiming to hold your breath, steadying your aim. And then the skill is locked until you acquire a prerequisite weapon. Oh, no. Okay. We have the rifle. Do you think it's the bow? <gasps> Guys, I think we might pick up a bow. Okay, I'm going to start putting into this. Oh, heck yeah. Let's go. I love how that manual was in the children's store, but I can look past that because I'm just happy right now. My sister, Rockstar. <laughs> that's just uncanny yeah the doodles where's the shoots and ladders but you're telling me it's been this long and we haven't found a single baseball card freaking superhero card i'm never gonna unsay that you guys just accept it i'm never gonna stop calling it a baseball card which is funny because I never even collected those. I never was like a card collector outside of those like, and this is going to sound crazy. I don't even know what to really call them. They're like, uh, who is this pirate game? I tried explaining this to chat once. It's like it was this pirate game that you would get cards and then you would build these tiny, tiny ships in like a little like a card style. You'd break it apart and you build these small ships. I don't remember what the game was called. It must have been like pirates and something, but it was so much fun because we had these little like our little board game piece boxes and everything. But that was the only kind of like card thing that I would buy. Oh, do you see that? Just in case. Yeah, all signs point to us getting a bow. My favorite weapon. And I think they make note of that too by having Boris. Oh, we're gonna find Boris's body with his bow. Boom. Prediction. Prediction. Boris's body and his bow. Oh yeah. Okay, let's see. Oh shit. Hope you did that, Tommy. What if it's not Tommy? What if it's Boris? But Boris probably. Boris was probably already taken out. Mm. All right, we've got a couple. I'm not clearing the area. I'm just going to shoot. Don't. We're not. Don't. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Ah, uh, give me that silencer. Give me that silencer. Okay. All right, I think it's just one, two more. Okay, so she's gonna come over here and then we're just gonna forever. Let's move up. Cause either way she'll come out. Oh no, she's going backwards. Well, I mean, I guess I could just run by. Probably don't have to fight her. Ideally would dodge the fighting, like needing to fight because I think I just have to jump up right here. Yeah, I don't have to deal with them at all. Hopefully I didn't 
No. I, I looked at it and I continued to jump in it. I recognize that. All right, there's something in the toy house. It is a baby rabbit. <gasps> mm. The loot goblin senses today. Unmatched. Wait, but it didn't even show me. Oh, there we go. Brainstorm trading card. No, not the journal. Nope. 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 <laughs> Come on, Ellie. There we go. Brainstorm. Oh. Okay. Let's see. Wait. His name is Brainstorm? And his brains are 90? But uh, what? Oh, brains 80? Not even 90? AQ? All right. A brawn 40. A tech billionaire with a taste of adrenaline. Brainstorm likes nothing better than to rush into danger and save the day, using inventions of his own creation. A real Iron Man, if you will. But there is a catch. He doesn't make a move until you decide how he should proceed. Through his crowdsource heroism app, Justify, who will be his next enemy? The choice rests in your hands. Oh, I don't like that. No, because what if, like, does he still vet it? Or can you just be like, hey, Sally stole my lunch money. Get her. And then he just kills them. What is this? Hold on. I don't like justice being in the hands of... Mm. I don't know about that. Yeah, like, what if Becky didn't let us go to the mall with her, and then we just decided to call Brainstorm on her? Is he going to take on that job? Freaking Becky. Becky's out. Yolanda, I'm sorry. I won't be able to keep taking care of Alfie. You were right about the wolves. They turned out to be worse than the military. What I didn't expect is that your our own neighborhood would turn on each other. They saw, they all saw what the wolves did to my poor Sophia. And what did everyone want to do in return? Appease? I deserved wolf blood. They should have joined me. Instead, they conspired against me. So I got them first. Flip it. Here we go. I poisoned them, one by one. Not enough to kill them, just to put them to sleep. Then I dragged them into a spore garage. Yuli woke up, we wrestled. I shut him in there, but he bit me. Those traitors are going to watch each other turn. They will suffer. I hope they will think of me when they lose their minds. I'm already starting to lose mine. It won't be long now. I hope you found peace somewhere outside of the shitty town. I hope you don't come back to see all of this. If you do, I'm sorry, Boris. Poor Jesus. man. Yeah, we're about to find Boris's bow. I'm calling it. Oh, that's such a nice piano. Oh, 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 oh. Hmm. Uh, let's see where we're at with that. I like getting these glimpses of what's going on outside. And I don't know, I think there is something really nice to the game giving you outside perspectives of the WLF or of these other groups, uh, the Fireflies included, because it kind of helps. Like, everybody has their own story. Everybody has their own bias. But it does help give you a more well-rounded sense of the group, depending on how much you take it. But I mean, that situation right there... I don't know how many different ways you can look at that. I mean, it sounds like they did really brutally murder a girl just for graffiti. Just because somebody stood out and had different beliefs. Fall into savings. With unbeatable deals, stop by Rosemounts today. Bring this coupon to get 25% off your entire purchase. I'm guessing we're going to this store for the bow and arrow. And the bow. Flies. There's a dead body through here. <gasps> oh. oh! It's not dead! It's not dead! It's not dead! It's not dead! Boris, give me that bow! <laughs> I thought it was flies. I thought it was a dead body, not Boris. I mean, I guess he is dead, kind of. Mm. Who was right? <laughs> That'll do. That'll do. Yeah. Check it out. You can see the space. Um, I'm looking at the pin right now, but Arrow's recipe unlocked, baby. All right. Tape and scissors. That is so awesome. 
I feel bad for Boris, though. I know he wanted his revenge, but it did sound like he got three WLF, and I mean, we've matched in that amount of numbers. We've taken three out. Well, not really us. And also, that gives us our answer that this is, in fact, Tommy. I know I kind of threw out the feeling of, okay, what if it's Boris and not Tommy? Because I just feel like the game keeps leading us. Sick. That's one way to use mannequins. I feel like the game just keeps giving us more... Let's see. All the sway is disgusting on right. this thing. Oh, perfect. Are we going for headshots now? Downwind a little. Still got it. You can sometimes recover in ah. Let's go furthest one. I want to see how far well I do. He has one in his hand. I'm gonna say right there. Ah, uh, that might have gone in his like crotch. Not sure about that one. Oh, those were oh, oh yeah. I mean, I would say different headshot, but uh, still effective. I got in his knee. Hold on, let me try again. Let me try again. I need to consider the... Yeah, yeah. Consider the distance and the... All right. Go a little bit faster. That one's pretty straight to the point. Okay, let's try going right there. No, hold on. The sway is so disgusting. There we go. All right, let's check that out. Dead shot. This one is going to be lower. Yeah, this one was still in the target, but definitely lower. I didn't consider... Yep, okay. The first one was the best one. Or the second one was the best one. The first one I messed up on. That's really cool. Mmm. So the bow should be hey, silent. Hey, we got another trespasser. A girl. A girl. Did you see her? No, but the fucking guy is nearby. Shit, the dog. Shit. We're looking for two. What the fuck's all that smoke? He blew up one of our trucks. How did that happen? <laughs> Just find them. Tommy's such I a badass. Fucking trespassers. All right. If we kill that guy, the dog is going to be set free. Let's go for the girl. Yeah, go for the girl to the right side. Loot as well. The thing is, I don't... I, I just feel like we have so many... We have a lot of... Oh, shoot. I should have surveyed the area first. We have a lot of items to the point where I'm not really... I feel like there's not a whole lot of reward from... Oh, he's coming over here. She's over. She's down here. Uh, Like, you know, playing it safe and easy is cool and fun. But I don't feel like there's a whole lot of drawback to being a little bit more reckless and just... Getting a quick little stab and grab. Quiet. <laughs> Guys, did you see how much faster that was? Dog has sent. That was so much faster. Okay. Okay, the scent is going to be a little crazy for the dog. Scent's gone. Scent's gone. Yeah, he lost our scent. That was so much faster. That was like two seconds. Ellie just got Hulk strength there. That was faster than I think Joel when he took down enemies. Mm. All right, he should be upstairs. Dog, I don't think has her scent anymore. Crouch still. He's not gonna find the dead body. Uh, did I not swap for that? There we go. Oh, that hit her in like the back thigh. That was such a bad shot. Wait, where? Who? In the house? In the house? No. That guy? What? Oh, wait a minute. Right there. Okay, that's not bad. We can work with that. I'm definitely going to need to upgrade my... Spidey senses. Back down, back down, back down. Where? Who? What? Is there somebody up top? Am I... Who is seeing us every time I step out like that? 
There. He has a dog. Damn it, dog. Dog made it clear. But dog doesn't have her scent. The dog doesn't have her scent. He thinks he knows, but he doesn't know. Oh, they know. Okay, maybe they know. I want every building in the area searched. Someone's out there. Just burn some things. They don't see you. I gotta shoot the dogs first. No! Ah! Hold on. Hold on. I gotta get through. I gotta go. Sloppy. Super sloppy, I know. Super sloppy, I know. I gotta kill dog first. Shit. Another dog? How many damn dogs? How many damn dogs? There were so many more than I anticipated. Okay. Hold on. I need to, I need to heal real quick. I need to heal real quick. I need to heal. Woo, there's a lot of puppers. Lots of Jacks brought some puppies. Over here. Probably coming from the right side if I had to guess. Okay, seeing my butt. I guess Ellie do be thick. She ducked over there. Down below. All right, let me get this. Cause if they, at least if they come up and through, we're good. Found her. Oh. Huh? Yeah, you found me. Take her down. Oh shit. So sloppy. I know. I know. Keep it up. There's so many. I didn't realize that there were this many. It is what it is. At this point. All right, we have one far away, one moving up right there. Baseball bat, no weapon. That's brutal. Damn, they did her dirty. <laughs> they did her so dirty. Are you gonna continue to move up like that? Whoa. I caught her! Right over here! <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, the only thing you caught were the bullets. Let me just crawl over and, uh... Get the items that she has with the dog should all be gone see my mistake was using or killing the guy with the bow that had the dog in front of other people too all right let me crawl behind here they're definitely isolated in that one area so they should come up through here and we'll find tommy too i'm not seeing anything let's go ahead and start running through some of these buildings and trying to get back a fraction of what i spent slaughtering these people silencer um let's go ahead and can i look do i hear a dog i think i hear a dog let me take the time to reload nothing to my name i have the bow we'll stick with the semi all right move up move up uh any items rag all right, let's go ahead and make some more, make a health kit. Bows, craft bows, arrows, sorry. All right, so you can hold six at a time. So we have six arrows, we're That's maxed on that. There's a, definitely she's near. I keep hearing her, but I don't really see her at all. Maybe we can find some snacks too. I have a feeling she is gonna kill us. I don't know what it is. It's just like this like feeling I get that I'm gonna die by. She saw us. Is she up top? She might be up top in one of those buildings. Oh, never mind. Eyes on. There's one more though. That was a guy. There's a female out there. He was the one that had uh, started spotting us. Hmm. Okay, I pressed towards the homes. What is that? Let me, I don't think I can craft any more Molotovs. Damn it. 
Give me another rag. I'm gonna stick with the rifle. I'm not picking anything up on my listen mode. Okay. Let's also remember to go upstairs too. Hmm. <gasps> oh, heck yes. Oh, yes, 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 yes. I get so excited by the loot you find in this game, though. <laughs> it's just good loot, okay? You gotta respect the... Oh, I feel bad. She doesn't even know. I think that is the last one, too. The last of us. I could just silent take her out, but honestly, just not using the rifle enough, and it's kind of satisfying to use the scope on it. Oh, wait. Dude, imagine needing a scope this close. I know. I know. Brutal. Ah. Uh, there's one more upstairs. Actually, that's funny. There's one more upstairs. Hmm. Shotgun? Shall we? We shall. Give him the Joel special. All right. <sighs> Although this one looks scripted. She's gonna open that door and not even know. Looking like a clicker right now with, uh, that was brutal. That's not the last one though. Ellie's not saying anything. Mm. Should I pick something up on the reading down there? No, I'm not picking anything up, but she's not saying anything either. All right, we're gonna craft a Molotov here soon. Grab the shotgun shells. Let's go ahead and let me make sure that I have everything maxed. Yeah, reload this bad boy. Hmm. Reload this. All right, let's go. I need to find more pistol ammo, but that can come with time. All right, craft a Molotov. Nice. The rags are a hot commodity. Like, they're really not giving us enough rags. Also, whose bed is this high up? Whose bed is this high up? Somebody tell me. <laughs> Honestly, I probably should have a bed that high up because maybe mine right now is too low, so it hurts my knee. <laughs> but come on. That is just asking for a monster to be under your bed, or maybe that's clever because I guess you're less likely to have a monster under your bed in that case because it is so wide that you can just see from any angle. Oh, okay, hold on. Uh, ma'am, please heal. They honestly give you med kits like it's candy. Out here giving prescription meds. Alright, did we come in through this way? No, we went straight to the right side. This must be where the stairs lead you to, if you go up through stairs. And then let's go ahead and craft another Molotov. We'll go Silencer next. Silencer after... Yeah, stairs. She didn't say that they're done, but I... I don't know where... Mm. Okay, so that's the house we just cleared. Oh! Or did we? I don't recognize this area. Maybe this is a different home. Yeah, it's gotta be. Nice. Ooh! I'm gonna go with the arrow. I don't know, the arrow is not great like at a time of panic, but if I can get a sneak shot on the person, I should be able to get a nice juicy arrow shot. No, this is the same place. I just didn't clear the left side of the house. All right, let's go back to over here where I slaughtered all the puppies. Um, Like here, let's go look in this house real quick. Oh, I also don't trust it either because I feel like they're prepping you for something. Like, I feel like Tommy and I are going to see the worst. 
the absolute worst. Can kind of run through fairly quickly. And what is that? And I didn't clear this house. Mm, no, we did. Yeah. This is where you can fall down. This is the initial house we came through. That I so foolishly <laughs> shot that guy and alerted everybody. True Maggie style. Let's craft it. The salad, sir. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. I still think there's one more alive, so I do want to be somewhat cautious. Please tell me I'm not the only one that... Everybody stop. Look at how beautiful this is. Wait. Hey. Oh here, my here. gosh. I have to deal with this bozo. I knew it, and I told you guys I was like... I was like, I need to not be so casual. Move in. There's multiple? Jeez. Buffoons. Oh god, I have to kill the dog. Oh god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die because of my admiration of their gorgeous- Are you kidding? I don't- I- You did not die by a silent shot? Yeah, killed your dog. I gotta go through. I gotta get cover. I gotta get cover. I have one shot in a dream. Somebody's shooting at me from behind? Uh, uh. Slicer. Slice. Slice. Please. I'm good. Please. Take it easy. Just take Did it they easy. take it easy on Joel? No, I'm just kidding. I knew she had nothing to, to do with that, but... Either way, I'm gonna need you to die, and then I'm gonna need your bullets, and I was not expecting there to be, like, six left. That's why my defenses were down. My defenses were down because I was just sitting there in awe of that beautiful outdoor cooking space. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm taking six bullets to the face while I'm admiring this and losing every... I wasted one of my silence shots on that dog. You've got to be joking me. But yeah, okay, back to where I was though. Look at how gorgeous this is. They even have an island, an island to go with their outdoor. I would say that it would be nice to have it covered a little bit. I definitely would do like a cute little pavilion over top of it and then maybe have some plants hanging down. But overall, great bones. I think we can work with this. <laughs> you guys know I'd have to go HGTV on any any game I'm playing. I've got to like go into. I. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to create a separate channel and it's going to be like me. <laughs> going into like a home of a certain video game and like what would you do how would i make this transform it into like joanna games this shit you know it's gonna be a new series i'm gonna run on this channel the video game home makeover all right let's go ahead and re-up all of that i'm over here like washington admiring the fireplace and i forget that we're in an active situation right now. We're going after Tommy. Sydney, you're messing around. All right, let's run up here real quick. We've been in this home. Um, but did I ever loot that body, by the way? I don't know if I did. It's okay. I'm not going to worry about that. Mm. See, that I don't see anything in these. Please give me that. I need that med kit. <laughs> I didn't do it. Uh, do we have max on this? Yeah. Let me open this real quick. Okay. <laughs> the one revolver shot and a dream. Oh, I almost missed that. Okay. I'm just jealous of all of these garages, to be honest. More people. All right, let me try to sneak this. I will try to be sneaky for this one, for you guys, for all the people out there that winces every time. 
TV station. I thought that was scars. I think these trespassers might be working with them. Dogs. Don't drop your guard. Okay. We have two situations going on right now. Should we go help? No. She's here. Hold your ground. Okay, if I grab her. There's a dog right by me. But grab her and kill her. The two second. Oh my god. The two second quick attack. Oh. oh. The dogs are for him, they're not for me. So we can get this silent kill off. I don't need to panic. Don't panic. Okay, she's gonna it's call Zoe. out the kill. Oh, there is a dog. There is a dog. There is a dog. Where did she come from? Where did she come from? Okay, over there. Okay. This is this is a recoverable situation. Dog's been taken out. Girl over there. More dogs? I can come back from this. I have all day, baby. It's like a staring contest, guys. You hold your spot because at the end of the day, I'm gonna grab her and I'm gonna spill it at her throat. And she's gonna be busy on a wild goose chase thinking I'm in that house right there. But in reality, I'm right behind her. <laughs> Shut it. Oh. Gosh. I have to say, like, I know I'm... Uh, keep in mind, I'm just... I'm not realistically thinking of revenge on all of these people because of Joel. I know that these are people that are aligned with the group that did slaughter Joel, but I don't hold them accountable for the sins or the actions of others. But that's the whole point of this game. Remember when I was telling you guys about that? Like, Naughty Dog did a fantastic job at making you feel conflicted in your own conscience of like what is right, what is wrong, who should be held accountable for the sins of other people, like all of this stuff. It's truly incredible that they create such a confrontation and confliction in your own beliefs and brain. I know for me it does that at least. Because for me, it's like, I think also when I start to play a game, I also, it's the same reason that I cry so much from seeing Joel or seeing those kind of sequences is because I truly feel like I try to put myself in the shoes of Ellie. I feel like I'm one with her. <laughs> Some Zen bullshit, but like, no, I really do try to put myself in the footsteps of whoever I'm playing. Um, and so I want to make sure that I do kind of say it's no, like, my actions are based on me, but they're also not, like, my personal actions or choices. Like, I think it's, like, a good combination between what I see as right, but then also what I would do considering who I am in a game. You know what I mean? Sorry for the ramble, but just, yeah, no. All right, so we're going to jump over here. Mm, more people. I need to put the silencer on. She's coming around the corner. She'll be coming around. <laughs> All right, one right there, moving in. I have to go this way before they rotate over. That's not a great spot for me to be in. On roof. Last one. All right. Oh! Freaking! Where did the dog even come from? Now I gotta slaughter this dog. Now I gotta slaughter this puppy. Oh, God, we haven't done a machete to the doggy yet. I didn't like it. I don't want to do it again. I'm sorry. All right, my silencer's out, though. And I only have three more shots with that. Let's go bow for the silence. Like, keep the, keep the sneaky on. Okay, we can press forward. We cleared the person on the roof. I do think we saw one more person move up, though. Uh, there was, like, one more person. Probably top side of the house, maybe? Or no, maybe there wasn't. Maybe I just saw the one individual. Mm. <laughs> I'm gonna need that snack bar. 
Y'all, I think just because of the situation, let's just go ahead and heal all the way. Man. I don't want to risk it. I know a lot of you guys are like, mm, you should probably put supplements into the crafting thing because you're starting to do a lot of that. No. I'm gonna max my other stuff first. I go full offense. Less need to be on the defense if you stay. Best defense is offense. I love the music here. It's because we're colliding. We have two situations colliding. This is so... This is going to be so good, you guys. This is going to be incredible. Over here! By the fence! Fuck! Alright, jump over here. Woo! Okay. Dropped in there. Smoke her out! Smoke her. Go, go, go! <coughs> what the hell? Alright. Stab him, stab him. I'm going to die here. I'm going to die. Yeah. Oh, they've got to be kidding me. What was that crazy? That was just like an insane assault just took place right there. Okay, maybe I was supposed to go somewhere else. And I couldn't have kept running. I'm going to have to stay topside. I'm going to have to go over here. Go over here. Okay, go over here. I got to go. I got to switch to my shotgun. All right, just stay right here. And as soon as they push in... It's effective. <laughs> she didn't die by it, though. She's dead. All right, two shots left on this. Uh, That should be it. That should be it. It's just the three people. They just pushed in a very aggressive assault right there, though. That was super aggressive. I think that might be... Is that, like, my second death? I definitely haven't taken that many deaths before. But now it's making me want to grab more smoke bombs and use it against them. Just shove it in their mouth. All right, we got a pool table, billiards, anything. There's definitely a superhero card here. Are you kidding me? There's got to be. I don't want to go ahead and heal up right now. I can't. I need to save to be able to craft another silencer. Anything, anything. That was so aggressive. Hold on. Okay. Push up, push up, push up. Uh, swap out, swap out. Okay, what do we got? Hmm? Doggy coming. I think that dog's still on its way. Uh, I want to heal, but I just, I, I don't at the same time. Okay, they're worrying about Joel. This is so cool. Okay, they've got him surrounded. We gotta go. We have to save him. Here we go. Cutscene? No. No cutscene. This is the scene where they make you think it's Joel. It's not Joel. Tommy? are you doing here what i think i'd let you do this on your own jesse jesse where's dina she's safe don't break it she she's needs to sick. tell him she needs to tell him I'm kind of sick she's fine like the you done messed up jesse <laughs> christ there's a lot of them did he come with tommy where did he come from what i have so many questions was he tracking you? the whole time? Was he with Tommy okay. the whole time? Your friends out there rushed me. No warning, no nothing. Mm. Tell me you didn't come alone. Give me shit about it later. How did he know where to go any Fucking more than we did? That, right? Yeah. Right. See that truck? Yeah. That's your plan. We need to get some distance. Can I just say that I feel like... You ready? Yeah. I'm just gonna pause for a second. Hold on, wait, wait, wait! I just wanna pause for a second. Um... 
Real quick, I have so much love and admiration for Naughty Dog, but I do feel like as somebody who consumes and loves their content, I feel personally betrayed by the way that they depicted that trailer. And although I know it was intentional and I'm sure they wanted to be able to drag people in and maybe knowing like giving you hope to believe that because you know in the trailer that somebody gets killed there and they perfectly structure it. So it does appear like it's Dina and it's not Joel. And that was very intentional. And I just, I don't hold it against them. I guess I'm just a little, I'm not mad. I'm disappointed kind of part, you know, like it's kind of like, I just wouldn't expect that kind of, um, I don't know. I feel like you don't have to use the smoke and mirrors to get me to enjoy the game or be intrigued or be emotionally connected to it. And so I just feel a little betrayed by that. I don't, I don't know. Maybe that's... Maybe that's misguided. Maybe that's not. And maybe I'm taking it too personal. I just think. Yeah. Here we go. I'm gonna grab her. Well, I'm gonna grab. Okay. Oh. And yeah. So like. That does answer that question. I did think in that moment it was gonna be Tommy that grabbed her. I thought it was gonna be Tommy. No sound off. Yeah, I thought it was going to be Tommy, and then it was going to hey. be like a mirage of it. Shannon? Uh, Jesse? Jesse? It's over. There we go. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Jesse. Okay, that just popped off for a second, but we should be fine. We should be fine. What yeah. Ellie, let's go. Got the keys. Let's go. We got the keys. All right, get in the truck. Get it. But where's Joel? I mean, where's Tommy? This is too okay. exposed. The window's out in the back. I am. More. Oh, yeah. The window shot out in the back. I think I get endless shots here. Jesse, get us the fuck out of here! I'm trying. Let's kill. Holy shit! I'm not getting headshots right now. The headshots are not Jesse. coming. Oh shit! Oh. Jesus. Jeez. Watch out. I'm not doing that. Go, go! Bye, Derek. Bye, bye. I'm just mad I didn't get her. I need a clear shot. Oh, jeez. I almost got him. I almost got him. I almost got him. Come on! Come on! Come on! Got him. All right, get the driver. Okay, Nathan Drake up there in the driver's seat. Killer. Look out! Oh. All right, that was short-lived. <laughs> that was really short-lived. Get her off, get her off. Do we even have a car line? Get out, get out, get out. Shit. Oh God. The windows are out, the windows are out. Everything's out, we're fine. We're fine. She can swim. She knows how to do this. Come on, Ellie. Your window's out too, Ellie. Okay. Gee. All right, so we should find Joel here, though. Or Tommy. I keep saying Joel. Mmm. That felt very, like, way more chaotic than it needed to be, but I guess they wanted to create a distraction, too. Possibly. But just okay. where did he come from? Okay. I think we're in the clear. The smoke. We need to go to the smoke. Oh, thanks. This way. Okay. 
We have to get to the stadium, too. We know now the stadium should be, too. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay, I'm tracking. Oh my gosh. I'm so... What just happened there? It was never Tommy. The person they had cornered was never Tommy. It was always Jesse. But Tommy did leave, so there is still Tommy out there. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't know why that took a second for me to connect the dots. Yes, okay. I'm tracking. It was always Jesse. It was not Tommy. They got that confused. We got that confused. That was like a, hey, like, surprise. Which I was surprised by it. I just, I was still focused on Tommy. Like, I'm still so focused on the Joel and Tommy combo, you know? Oh, gosh, this is going to be, this is going to be interesting. Oh, my God. Also, hey, hey. Oh. Hey. You okay? Nothing little sleep won't take care of. Ellie knows they need to talk. We should get inside. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Come on. Easy. Huh? How'd you get past Maria? I had to sneak out. Huh. Friends' problems are my problems. Oh. Aren't you sick? Oh, it's. It's just a stomach thing. Come on. Actually, I Let's do think down, if huh? Jesse knew, he would not want her doing anything dangerous. Uh, you don't need to do that. Oh, shut up. At least so awkward Jesse. right now. Day after you, there was bad snow when I crossed into Oregon. I've been doing 18 hour stretches for the past two weeks trying to catch it. Aww. Tommy. Huh? Are you with me? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Look at how beautiful it is. Anyway. Two years earlier. Silent treatment. <laughs> Man. Yes. Can I just tell us to be like, I'm really glad that they're giving us some more information about Tommy. You guys know I've been asking for that for a while, but all right. So the, the <laughs> neurons are working again. Okay. So I figured that whole scene out. I feel really bad for Ellie because I know she's probably, I would say it's a valid worry for her to believe that maybe her relationship with Dina would cease considering the child on the way. Um, but I just, I know, I think Ellie struggles to feel alone a lot. And so I think for the first time after she had Dina, especially with everything happening, um, it's really easy to cling on to that relationship and hope and everything. And so I think she's worried that that's a possibly threatened, but I know Dina and I know Dina's character and I don't think that the baby would change anything. I think if anything, um, you know, she'd want Ellie to be a lot like a, big presence in that and I think she would stay with Ellie. Own birthday if she didn't remind me when it was. <laughs> you should just apologize to her. I just, just said... Okay. What's going on? Nothing. Why? I can tell you're off. off. Mm. <sighs> okay. Got some stuff on my mind. Clearly. Oh. Okay. Clearly. Let's get in. Okay, here we go. This is going to give us good insight to probably how she feels right now. I've just had the worst best day of my life. Kat was finishing another session on my arm, then climbed on top of me and kissed me. I threw her off of me. I yelled at her. I thought I infected her. I mean, I'm infected, sort of. I don't know how this shit transfers. What if she turns? What would I tell people? She's got family. I told her we should just take a walk. I lied and said I'd never kissed anyone, and that was why I was nervous. She was actually sweet about my freak out. We spent the day walking and talking. Then she came to my place for a movie. She fell asleep, and I stayed up all night watching her. It's cute. Cute and stalkerish at the same time. Looking for signs of infection. Okay, okay, okay. Redeemed, redeemed. Uh, the next morning, she was fine. Nothing. I'm not contagious, and Kat likes me. What a roller coaster. So on pa oh, Kat's the best. That is all. So on patrol today, Jesse told me Kat referred to me as her girlfriend. She's so open about everything. She talks about her mom. Wait, she talks to her mom about us. She held my hand while we were all out at the lake. Kissed me in front of my friends. Everyone seems to know except for Joel. Should I tell him? I don't know. I don't know how he'd react. 
I feel like Dean is avoiding me. Kat says she's just jealous about how I'm spending my time. I keep trying to invite Dina along, but she keeps saying she's busy. Lying on a stone, perched on, perched on an outcropping. Trace, stung, oh wait, you trace constellations in the sky. I trace the ink on your skin that covers the scars, the burns, decorating the darkness like stars. It smells like wet leaves and firewood out here. <laughs> Is that what we just wrote? <laughs> okay, so yeah. It sounds like Dina's liked her for quite some time, you know? So I feel like she should have um, confidence in that, you know? Like, I, I really don't think the baby's going to change. It's definitely not going to change Dina's feelings about her. Got stragglers. How many? Hmm. Just a handful. I see a couple. Nice shot, Tommy. Disgusting. Tommy and I have a matching bun. Give it a whirl. <laughs> Heck yeah. Are you sure? Well, I'm feeling generous. <laughs> okay, so we now know. I mean, not that we didn't know it before, but Tommy is an incredible shot. See that sign there? Red one? Mm -hmm. Try hitting that. Good way to draw them out of where they're hiding. Got to aim higher. What? Oh. The bullet room to drop. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry. Way too high. Shit. Make sure to compensate for the bullet drop. There we go. Yeah, yeah, bullet drop. Go. Okay. Give me a Sounds second. Attracting them. That was really bad. We are on patrol. Let's clear them out. I'm just gonna wait till they relax just a second. Okay. Go. That was good. That was good. That ain't bad. Clipped his leg. Gotcha. I like this thing. That's all of them. Usually more over Not this bad. You want to keep shooting? Okay. Hmm. What did he say? If I want to keep shooting? Oh, he'll let me keep it. Where are they coming from? Hordes like to move through this area in winter. In winter. They always end up leaving behind a few stragglers. They do the same routes every year? Like a migration or something. Wow, that's really that interesting. About? Well, when the barometric pressure reaches a certain temperature... St shit, I don't <laughs> fucking know. No, but that's so cool. It's just like creatures, though. It's just like, uh... Check out the shed. Animals, Looks you like know? they're moving downhill. Why? Uh... Dead animal. Look up by the truck there. They're munching on the food. Up by the hungry. truck? Up by the truck? Oh. Dead deer, dead deer. Oh, yeah. Mm, wait, I don't see a dead deer. Am I missing it? There's the truck. I'm trying to see just, like, the slightest of movement out there. I know he wants me to find this dead deer, but... He said out by the truck, right? Yeah, there we go. Ah, uh, he wanted us to draw them out. On the move. There we go. Looks Yay. clear. Bet there's some this way. I mean, this is my type of infection clear out from afar and there's something by the ski lifts? Look way out there. Under those guns. Mm. By that tunnel. Oh, that's going to be wicked long. Oh, that's a wicked long shot. Okay, I guess the one before was longer, too. All right, let's go for this one first. All right, one down. Okay, I need to relax. I'm, I'm definitely, like, lobbing them like grenades right now. I guess maybe I need to do... I think I need to line these ones up with the yes, ah, line them up with the furthest smells. tick. You know, like the the furthest one down. Because of the distance. Yep, yep, that's exactly it. What should they do? Yep, low tick. I just have to be Took me a while to get the hang of this. Yeah. Wait, that's so cool. 
project where he's gonna walk. Nice. Okay. You're really getting it. Yeah. Yes. Well, I'm not seeing any more. Yeah, me neither. All right. Oh yeah, Let's look. See, see if Joel's back. She yeah. just started the tattoo. You can see it's like really just the beginning stages of it. That's so cool. <laughs> and her over. Hey, thanks for that. It's just what I needed. Sure. Nah. Ladies first. That's really nice. I'm not supposed to say anything, but Joel's worried about you. There's, there's nothing to worry about. Well, I'm sure there isn't. Mm -hmm. But if you don't talk to him, he's going to think something's wrong. I talk to him. Well, you have to do more than hi and bye. <sighs> okay, I will try. <laughs> Aww. At ease, fellas. Did Joel send her out with Tommy for that kind of quick conversation? I'm not supposed to say anything. We know what that means. All right, let me go have a talk with Joel. That was y'all shooting out there, right? Oh, just some stragglers. Ellie got to try out my scope. And wasting a lot of bullets. The like? scope was nice, though. Yeah, feels good. Oh. I see you've, uh, you haven't gotten around to changing the strings yet. I didn't know I was supposed to. <laughs> yeah, you'll, uh, we'll get you some new ones. <laughs> <clears throat> well, there's that music store down there. Oh, yeah. I bet they got guitar stuff. You guys should go together. I mean, that area's long overdue for a sweep anyway. <laughs> Look at Joel looking at him. He knows exactly what watch. he's doing. Where you say, kiddo? Sure. And that's our cue. <laughs> Optional dialogue. Are you sure you don't want to come? Get on now. He's waiting. <sighs> I just, how is it possible to make two incredibly loving characters huh? like Joel and Tommy? On me, kiddo. You know? So. You and Tommy cross anything when you was out? Just the few we saw from the ridge. You? Uh, you know, found two runners in a house. Oh. Jesse tells me you're handling your own quite well on the group patrols. He's even recommending you for paired patrols. What? Well, I think you're still a bit young for it. I'm a better shot than almost all of them. <sighs> and I have more experience than most of the new recruits Look. who've... You think you're ready. I trust you. Okay. Aww. Thanks. You just do me a favor and start with the shorter routes for now. You know, see how you handle them. This All is right. so beautiful. Hey, you remember those uh Savage Starlight call yes. that you're into? Yeah. Tommy and I found some when we were moving through that school the other day. Did you like them? Oh, well, you know what? not really my cup of tea. <laughs> Dr. Daniela Starr, I mean, she's pretty... She's a savage. Well, what she does to Captain Ryan and that... <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. I remember that. Yeah. I mean, he definitely deserved it, but... That was a nice twist how they escaped, though. <laughs> You're funny. Aw, he probably read them to have something to talk about with her, you know? Like he wants to be into yeah, what she's into. That way. I'm gonna have to leave the horses here. Yeah, that sounds good. Uh, All right, we might have some into trouble. Shimmer. Ah, <laughs> uh, I'll miss her. She was good. Best of horses. You need a boost. I got it. This is that like I think it's funny. Uh, I don't think we can go this way. What? Hmm. What do you think? Well, damn. We gotta move through the house. Be able to swim across this. Okay, so now what? Well, if you're up for it, we can try cutting through that hotel. Right I'm up on. For it. 
Um, this is totally that just I think it just happens with most teenagers, but it's that like in between, you know, stage where it's like the parents trying to have like some kind of similar interest with you still be kind of close, but especially when you start like dating and things like that. Hmm. I guess I need to well, I think we just need to go around. I don't know why he's staring up at that. It's down here, by the way. Any superhero cards? Maybe in the cop car. <sighs> Damn it. Oh, that might be something. Hmm. You think you can fit in there? Go prone in? worth a shot. <laughs> okay. Careful now. Yep. <laughs> I'm through. Hold on. All right, grab everything we can. Oh, I thought it was a starlight. Uh, not starlight. I thought it was a superhero card. Just by the way that it was shining. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I feel like when we're doing these sequences with uh, Joel, it's not like we get to keep what we find. Really. Uh, not too looking. much. Nice. Well, hello. Howdy. You Howdy. Impressed? Nope. You're just too skinny. You need to eat more. <sighs> You're welcome. <laughs> I'm just dead by his howdy. Joel's little howdy. All right, health pack. I mean, maybe we do. I guess maybe, wait, do we still have... Mm, I don't know, maybe we had what we had... No, because they're different time occurrences, too. Like, the previous one was three years ago. Really? This one's yeah. two years ago. This place is giving me the creeps. Yeah. I think I see a way through, but we got spores. Just put your mask on. Oh, do I have to? It's just us. What if we run into someone? Okay, fine. That's true. Better safe than sorry. gotta be smart about this you start wearing that mask kiddo yeah eventually you're gonna slip up in front of someone you shouldn't i've never oh. slipped you ain't told nobody do have you not jesse or dina or... of course not okay good mm. and i actually i did keep that promise yeah. didn't i up until just recently i mean we did try to tell her you but the in here before that was after everything. Uh, you just patrol the streets. Feel like uh, a bit of an oversight now. Maybe. Feel like there could be something in here. Maybe a card. Mmm, some ammo. I'll take it. I can open the door too. And just go out to the hallway to meet up with him. Yeah. Weird. Looks like it was shot a while back. When did the last patrol go through here? I'm not sure. Is it one Ooh. of us? <sighs> Only people went missing from Jackson and teenagers from last year. This one's too old. Got teenagers old went missing? Huh. Maybe they went somewhere else? Here we go. Ruby. I'm sorry if our patrol overwhelmed you yesterday. We don't run into new people too often. I understand why you might have been nervous to follow us to Jackson, but it really is a nice place. We've got electricity, good crops, could do something special for you and your family. My boys are different people here. Before Jackson, we were focused on just staying alive. I didn't like who they were becoming. They started acting like the people we were running from, running away from. These days, they're on roofs fixing holes, digging trenches, hard work, but they come home every night excited about building up this place. They've got community, a reason to be accountable. You used to be a teacher. You could have a classroom of kids hungry for knowledge. This isn't a fantasy. Please consider stopping by, at least. Let me show you around, Tara. Oh, Tara. Okay, interesting. Alcohol. Mm, there's something on the ground. Oh, brick. 
All right, I've got some more alcohol and a board. Ah, uh, wonder if that's the family that turned. Or Ruby, wait, 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 wait. Didn't Ruby and her family end up coming? I don't know why, but I recognize their name Ruby on the roster for patrols. Maybe, why am I blinking on that? Hmm. Were we going through 108? Or no? Where did Joel go? Joel? Oh, there we go. This way. Should be the exit. Yeah. Clicker. Come here. That is not my stomach this time. That's a clicker. <gasps> okay, okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Patrol, right? Okay. Yeah. Let's take him out. <gasps> this was that time she told Dina about. Remember when Dina told her? Remember? <laughs> Remember when Dina said that one time Joel and I took out like a bunch of people in the hotel? This was that time. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Okay, I think Joel is single-handedly taking them all out. Oh. Grab the straggler. The one that came from behind? It doesn't make sense. Got him. Nice. Where's the other one? Right there, right? And then a clicker. When it turns around. When it turns around, I'll jump. Joel's next to me. Joel's like, you got this, kiddo. I know, that was kind of risky. I did run there a little bit. But I know it's just a clicker left. No, there's not. There's a runner behind, too. Runner behind, runner behind. Ah! Joel, move your big old butt. Joel! Joel! Joel, please. Okay. Health pack. Okay, when this runner comes back around. Joel, please. You're messing me up. Jeez. All right, grab this too. Okay, okay. Get the clicker and then we're done. It's gonna turn around. Got him. Nice. Another flaming hot Cheeto down. Alright, we have a rag right here, but we're full up on that. I don't think can I I mean I guess I can grab Molotovs. Joel. I think we did it. I'd say so. Good job, kiddo. Oh, yeah. Me too. It's just so endearing. So, what do you say we give up on those strings for today? Could have said it better myself. <sighs> All right. Way out is forward now. We're giving up on the strings, though. We came all this way through this hotel, and we're not gonna go. <clears throat> hmm. I mean, I guess they weren't expecting a spore-infested hotel, so yeah. That looks like it might be something. You first. Oh, you. Definitely you first. Bloater. It's cool we got to see Ellie look back there. I don't know why I really like that. Yeah, I hear it. That's a bloater. That's a bloater. Oh, that's a bloater. Look at its mouth. I don't think I've ever seen its mouth like that. No, run after and save Joel. Double barrels. Oh 
gosh, oh gosh. Oh, it's charging! Joel! Joel! I gotta go, he's throwing something. Smack him, smack this one. Mm. Mm. I don't remember it taking so long to kill one. I forgot he can run through that kind of stuff. Oh, I fell. I'm going through here. Ah! Joel! Woo! Joel! Wait, I have a Molotov! I have a Molotov! Okay. What? What? I'm in the middle of something! I know Ellie can take care of herself, but in that situation, Joel, please. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen a bloater take that many hits. It was too close. Yeah. Sure. But we fucking did it. Well, he ripped my mask off. <laughs> I was sure did. Oh my gosh, okay. great balls of fire. You know, than being really old. <laughs> ain't nothing solid, not a sleep on psycho. Well, that's fair. I wanna get out of here. Yeah. Yeah. Let's reload and then get out of here. Yep, this was exactly that time that she was telling Dina about in the hotel. I knew it for some reason. It's funny because I, I predicted the bloater. I guess it's because I I just felt like this was going to turn into something more. Like it wasn't just going to be as easy as um, a couple of. It was too, the scene of like slowly crawling through. It was too convenient to have somebody come like running through and grabbing us, you know? All right, I guess we can go through here. Or never mind, Joel found it. I thought that was the way, but it didn't give me a prompt. What if there's like two bloaters back there? It'll be fine. Okay. I trust Joel. I trust him. Spores are clear. Quite the fight back there, huh? Oh, this is a nice Not gym. A load around these parts. Yeah. Jesse and Nada. Dina are gonna lose their shit when they hear about this. Let's deal with them too, anyway. The date, right? Oh. Uh, on and off. Here we go. Here Why? we go. I hear the way Jesse talks about you. No, Jesse and I are just friends. <laughs> no, no, no. I've got a pretty keen eye for these sort of things. I don't Not think so you're keen with this one. Too, Joe. <laughs> Don't hold your breath. <laughs> I don't think you do, Joel. Hmm. One more? Why can't we just go through the exits? How many exits does this hotel have? Good lord. You think you can squeeze through there? Yeah. Do I want to squeeze through here? <clears throat> See what it is? Hmm. Yeah. Okay. He is giving her a lot more, um, like trust and freedom. I think. No, that's one of ours. <laughs> that's a Jackson logo. Yeah. Who is it? The teenagers? Hey, Joel. Huh? I think it's them. The teenagers. A couple that ran away last year. Oh. Oh. The note. I think you're right. Hmm. Jackson is a wonderful place, but we got tired of hearing the stories of people suffering everywhere else. We wanted to save lives. We had good intentions. We didn't make it an hour before running into a horde. Oh. Now we're bitten. 
We've decided we're gonna end our lives instead of turning. Oh, man. Sad. Let's tell our family and friends that we're sorry. Both Adam and Sydney. Hmm. I shot her. I can't take my own life. I'm a fucking coward. Adam. <sighs> Only they were immune, right? Oh no, here we go. <clears throat> well, let's... Let's go get Tommy and we can get these bodies back to Jackson. After you took me out of the Firefly Hospital, you said there were dozens of people like me. Then how come there's not a cure out there yet? Yeah. Yeah, that's what they told me. I've never met another immune person before. Have you? I could be hiding it. You do. Do you believe that? Is now really the time for this? We traveled across the entire country to bring me to the Fireflies. I had so many questions for them. And what do they do to you? Why did you pull me out of there while I was still unconscious? Because I let them run their tests. And when I saw that they were useless, I got us out of there. How do you know they were useless? Maybe if you, you just uh, would have given them more time, they could have figured uh, something out. There was no cure. I wish he would tell her the truth. There's nothing that could help these people or anybody else. I know you wish things were different. I wish things were different. But they ain't. And we need to get these kids back to their families. Is there something else you'd like to rehash? I just wish he would tell her the truth because she, I think she would understand why he did that and didn't let it go through. I really do. Ooh. All right, so we're back. So I also think there's there's something really interesting there. And I think this is a good stopping point because we're going to go into the next um, section where we're probably going to talk to Dina and uh, Jesse about the next move. And hopefully we do find Tommy. They keep, I'm a little worried, you guys. They keep stringing us along that we're going to find Tommy. And I'm actually worried that the damage we have seen so far was never Tommy. It was always Jesse. So that leads me to believe that Tommy might have been captured. And I, I don't know. I just... I can't go through to see another one of them die like that, especially by the hands of the WLF and especially by Abby. Um, I think there's something really cool about seeing these uh, flashbacks. For one, the one from three years ago, he really didn't like that she was going through and traveling alone in the second half of the museum. Whereas in this one, she's like able to move, I think, and he trusts her more. Like you can see that he actually is willing to have her be more like he even said she can go out on these patrols but yeah just in like a year's difference you know like he's he's giving her that space that she needs but i think right now it's coming back up like she's got a lot of emotions going we got a lot of hormones happening like we have to remember that even despite all of these post-apocalyptic circumstances like we still have just our normal human uh, hormones that we go through as we're growing up and ellie is in the height of it like she is in the she's in the thick of it to say the least and so you can see by her notebook like she's 
feeling these certain ways between Kat and Dina and she's she's got a lot of emotions thrown into a relationship and you can see that she hasn't told Joel yet um you know that she has a girlfriend and so I think that's probably weighing her down a little bit I think she is still like trying to process and internalize that she possibly could have helped people and she never got to see that through because he's kept with this lie and i really do believe that she would understand him pulling her away if she only knew what they were going to do what it was going to cause to her i know ellie is very selfless in a lot of ways and she loves and cares about people so deeply but I'm also not sure she'd be willing to sacrifice herself for that cause. I really don't. I don't think any of us can really say that with certainty. So I just wish, um, just like Joel is trusting her more and more as she's getting older, I wish he would trust her with the truth as well. But I think for him, he's worried that it would push her away, like, immeasurably now that there has been a lot of time since he first got her away from that. And so... While I don't think you can come back from a lie, like, I, I'm i sorry, I don't think you can't, like, not come back from a lie. I think there's always time to tell somebody the truth. I do think what happens is the more that you take more time to let it sit with them, it's going to hit them harder when they hear the truth. And so I think that's what caused that rift, because this was two years ago, and we know that just about a couple months ago, Joel and I were on the outskirts, um, or we're on the outs. And so I think... They're going to give us another cutscene. It seems pretty, we're, we're, t we're, sorry, I'm struggling with words right now and I'm rambling. We are starting to see more flashbacks. And so I think we'll definitely see the flashback where he finally breaks down and tells her the truth. And I do think it's going to come from him. I don't think it's going to come from Tommy. I know I trust Tommy and Maria fully. I don't think it's going to like spill out from them, but yeah, I'm, I'm not looking forward to seeing that because I just don't think she's going to take it well. Um, but yeah, that was a really interesting episode. It took me a second to process Jesse being Tommy, like in that situation. I know that took me way too long to process that. But yeah, so I'll be looking out for Tommy in the next couple of segments. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. It was definitely action packed <laughs> and um, definitely sloppy. I think I was a little bit sloppy when it came to killing people. But at this point, like I'm not worried about it. I feel like... With WLF, I don't really want to sneak around them. I have no problem. Just, they also are giving us a lot of them. Like, that was a segment where we had a lot to kill. And so while I did handle it sloppy, we got through, and that's what matters. So I will see you guys in the next video. And as always, thank you for your time. Bye. realize you accidentally just shook up a bottle please do not